The firefighter being treated here at Loyola Medical Center is listed in serious condition after battling that house fire. CFD is not identifying the victim, but says he's a longtime firefighter and has been with the department since the 90s. Emergency sirens were heard blaring Friday afternoon on this far northwest side street. Smoke can be seen in this cell phone video coming from the basement of a nearby home while firefighters work to extinguish a fire that left three of their own hurt, one of them in serious condition. All of a sudden, I've heard my neighbors screaming, my house is on fire, my house, like something with the basement. The homeowner who did not want to go on camera tells me he was at his home of 28 years on Balmoral near Cumberland when the fire started in his basement. He believes it was possibly electrical in nature. The family alarm in the main, made it, made it, made it. Also fire went down in the basement, made it, made it, made it. And it was in his basement where a CFD spokesperson tells us two of the injured firefighters were hurt. It's unclear whether they were hurt while in the basement or if they fell through the floor into the basement while battling the fire. A third firefighter was injured outside of the home and was taken to the hospital to be checked out. Neighbors describing the efforts to tackle the smoke and flames. At first it looked like there was smoke in the back, but then they were on the roof and they were um, cutting holes in the roof. And when they opened the front door, I've never seen so much smoke in my life. The homeowner making it out safely, though with most of his belongings now destroyed. Mayor Brandon Johnson posting on social media saying he's praying for the firefighters recovery. CFD says the other two firefighters are expected to be OK. Watch breaking news on YouTube. Subscribe to ABC7 Chicago Eyewitness News.